All right, so if you're working with your own characters or objects and really want to use those in a, uh, an efficient way, you can actually combine them in states, the similar to what you do with maybe your own custom characters using the built-in photographic or illustrated characters, you can actually bring in your own uh, characters. And I know a lot of folks have uh, specific photos they use of either uh, their industry or their workplace. Um, you can absolutely work with those to create your own custom character packs. So in this example, this is just a, uh, a large image I had uh, purchased from Shutterstock. And what I did was just knocked out the white background and then put each of these objects, or at least several of them, on their own layer with a transparent background. Once I save those out as individual PNG files, I can then just bring them into Storyline to build out my, my character packs. So in this case, it's a finished version. Click States. You can see I brought in several of those characters, right? Now they don't have the, uh, these aren't all integrated in the sense that they have uh, similar poses, one person with multiple poses and expressions, but it is a neat way and an easy way to manage a series of characters that I might use throughout a course or uh, future projects. Now these are just the single graphics, right? So I would want to bring in additional characters. So if I wanted to create another character pack, say out of her, click Edit States, create a new state, and I'll just call it two, just to keep it simple. Click Add, and then really just duplicates that normal state, that first state. Now I can go ahead and right click and choose Change Picture, and then find a uh, different photo. Now if it resizes it like that, I might want to come up here, repicture, uh, size and picture. And then I'd also probably want to use the uh, drawing guides to help center and align that. But real super simple way to manage um, your own custom objects or characters using your existing uh, photographic or illustrated library.